Hello floss tube. My name is Sarah. I am from Memphis and this is my channel about cross stitch. Today is Sunday, December the 5th and it's day five of Flossmas. I know this is coming to y'all late. I talked about it yesterday. I worked that fabulous 12 hour shift today and then got a little bit caught up. So I'm just now getting in, getting settled. No tea for me tonight. Um, I am having a delicious zero sugar sun kissed in um, my Central Barbecue cup, which if you're from Memphis, you're familiar with Central Barbecue. If you're not, you might be familiar with Central Barbecue. Memphis is the barbecue capital of the world. We have good stuff here. Mm. Yeah, come to Memphis eat some barbecue. All right, so no uh, tea tonight. I'm doing soda because, just because seemed more refreshing. It's really hot outside and it's humid and my hair, I promise, did not look this bad while I was at work today, but just being outside and doing a few things before I f filmed this, um, yeah, this was the hair situation. All right, so let's see. After I finished with y'all last night, what did I do? I did some stitching and I watched one of my favorite Christmas movies. I watched Arthur Christmas. Daughter, I'd never seen Arthur Christmas before. I love Arthur Christmas. It's the cutest. If you haven't seen it, go check it out. Um, yeah, so let me just show you what I stitched on. Some last night, some today. I might I had a break and I got lunch, so I got a lunch. That's a good thing. Um, this is um so Forbidden Fiber Co. I have their Yule Ball Advent box. And part of their box is a mystery stitch along. The pattern's by Michelle Bendy Stitchy. And the fabric and floss are by Forbidden Fiber Co. And then there's other little goodies thrown in along the way. Today we are on a goodie day. So it was yesterday when we got a new part of the pattern and a new color. I've barely began to stitch with the new color. But I did finish the first three pages from day one with the diamond. And then I started a little bit with the Persephone. There we go. There's a big long Sarah here on there. Well, you get the idea though, right? So, that's what we're looking like right now. Yes, very fun. So I'm gonna stitch some more on this tonight and go visit with my husband for a little while after I finish up with you all. And then my other thing that I worked on today um, is my Nutcracker by RITM. I have a couple pages left to finish on it. Hoping to finish it by Wednesday. It's not looking real promising. I have work, work. Yeah, I'm a 14 hour work day on Tuesday. So, and I really barely get to take a break on that day. So probably I'm not gonna finish it, but hey, it was a good idea, right? But so from the last time that you saw this, I think I was just starting these, the Nutcracker's Little Funky Pants. So I finished part of the pant leg today and part of a shoe. Feeling pretty good about that. Yeah, it's a little bit of a tricky pattern to stitch because it was a little different on either side, but it came out okay. All right, um, I didn't get any haul today. I might have gotten some haul today, but I haven't opened it, so I won't be showing any haul today, but I would like to go on and open the advent boxes. So if you have not opened day five of the Forbidden Fiber Co. Yule Ball, um, advent box, then look away. Today it's in a really cute little fuchsia velvet bag. Super sweet. I'm sure I'll find something, something good to put in here. All right. Coming at you, coming at you. I don't know why I spent all that time in the beginning of this telling you about barbecue, but really trust me, the barbecue in Memphis is amazing. And oh my gosh, this is so cute. I am, oh, this is, this is so cute. Do you see this? Look on the back. I, this is a cute needle minder. I love this. Hold on a minute. Hold on. What's it say? What's it say? Yeah. Needle minder. Suns, moons, and stars. When you think of celestial, you think of the sky. This star needle minder will keep track of your needle anytime you need a stitching break. Isn't it cute? I love it. And it's got a button for the back. Super cute. Yay! That makes me really happy. I'm even just like 
getting rid of, sorry to hear my cat, Edward. He needs to, I think he needs some attention because I've been at work all day between him and Winnie. Let's see. Ooh, yeah, girl, here we go. I love it. It's perfect. So cute. So cute. Okay. All right. All right, let's do day five of the 25 days of Christmas Advent box from Kitten Stitcher. Just a reminder, these items may be for sale by the people who make them um, in 2022. So we're in day five. Day five. Let's see what we got here. Mm. Oh, this is silken colors by the Thread Gatherer. I've never had any Thread Gatherer. German glass glitter. Oh. Wow, look. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, I like this. I'm excited about this. That's gorgeous. Oh, I have never tried this before. It is super, super soft. Like maybe softer than Loyana. Wow. I like this. This is beautiful. I'm excited to use this. Five yards. Um, color fastness not guaranteed. Yay! That's exciting. I love it. I love it. So tomorrow I'll be back to open day six. And it might not be this late, but it's going to be another, I can almost guarantee it's going to be another evening opening. Um, let's see. So plans are, I'm going to go get out of these clothes, put my feet up, talk to my husband, do a little stitching on the Yule ball, go to bed and get back up at it again in the morning. I've got some ironing to do too, but I think I'm going to be a procrastinator and do it in the morning. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. Let me show you some of my um, happy Christmas stash. Oh, and hmm, almost forgot yesterday, my daughter and son-in-law brought me the things from their Disney trip that um, they got for me. I'll show you one of them tonight. How about that? I'll save a few from the other night. They got me a, I love this, 50th anniversary ornament. Now, the cool thing about this, which I don't know if you'll be able to see this. Like, can you see it changes colors? The fireworks. Oh, my gosh. This is amazing. This is quite possibly the most amazing Christmas ornament I've ever had. Yeah. Yeah. It's gorgeous. It's, go oh, yes, and it was $24.99, <laughs> but there we go. I love it, right? Okay, let me just show you a couple of my fun little Christmas stash. Like I said, that I'm not stitching this year, but I will stitch some year. Let's do a couple of these, let's see. All right, first one's gonna be from Country Cottage Needleworks, Silent Night. I love this one and I love it on the blue. I basically love pretty much if you if you were to chart a pattern on blue, I would love it. I mean, blue's my favorite color, but I love things on blue. I think they're beautiful. I'm super excited to get my piece of blue fabric from um, Fabrics by Stephanie so I can stitch the cookie exchange. This is sweet, isn't it? I love that. And another piece of my stash. This is by Kore E. Batakore. I did terrible at that, I have no doubt. Christmas in the snow. Ha oh, isn't this pretty? This one's big, I think. Or at least whenever people stitch these, they talk about how big they are. Let's see what it says. 32 count, no. This just talks about the, let's investigate, shall we? Sorry. Oh wait, stitch count, 234 by 205, so yeah, pretty big. Oh my gosh, isn't it cute? Though? Look at that tree. Ah, oh my gosh, I really want to stitch this one. Just looking at it, look, look at that. Oh, ooh, I'm feeling tempted. I'm feeling tempted to go off the rails here. It just takes DMC, 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen colors of DMC. I know I have some fabric I could put it on. Hmm. It's a possibility. That tree is amazing. You see that? Mm. Okay. Refocus. No, I don't know. I'm really excited about this one all of a sudden. Hmm. This might bump somebody. Even though I've already kitted this, this might bump somebody for real. Okay, so I really think that's it for tonight. I hope everyone's had a wonderful weekend. Um, <clears throat> has a great week ahead of them. I will be back tomorrow with day number six. That means for Forbidden Fiber Co., that'll be another part of that pattern and some floss. And who knows what's coming up in that kitten stitcher box. But I really like this today. This is good. It's good. So beautiful. All right. Y'all have a good evening. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.